Healing crystals, skincare routines, knitting a sweater, fitting in jeans. With Katie and Sarah, no need to worry, you're on a lady journey. Man, we're it's starting. <laughs> That's how I go into Welcome parties. Welcome to Lady Journey. <laughs> Welcome to Lady Journey. We have Mia Jackson, fabulous yeah, guest thank today. Thank you for coming. Mia, you. you're amazing. Thank you so much no, yes. for coming. No, you are. Oh my gosh, Come on. We, are. we are. We all are. This is how we start every Lady Journey. Come on. A compliment. Just... It's, it turns into a fight. Yeah, <laughs> a certain way, it's a conflict. No, no you're amazing. Stop. <sighs> Thank you. Thank Mia, you you're you're me. an amazing comic. I remember the first time I saw you perform, I saw you at the Laughing Skull Festival in like 20, must have been like 2016 or something. Ooh. I think you maybe won that year or you, you no, ended up going to JFL I, that year. 2017. 2017. 2017. Yeah, you I, were yeah. so good. You and me were on a showcase together. I saw you. I was like blown away by how hilarious you were. Stop it. Look, I'm like, ah. oh, you're so funny. I can't take these compliments. I know. And then, yeah. and then another time when I was in Atlanta, you gave me a ride, and we bonded for like 45 minutes in the car. Where, where, where was that? We were, was that the, was that a festival? Was it? I think that maybe was I it? was in town doing shows, and then I remember you telling me, "Or are you from Marietta?" No, I mean, I probably well, I lived in. I lived in Sandy Springs. Okay, so I'm, but yeah. If I, but I'm, I'm sure. I, I feel like that was that the Red Clay Festival. It, it might have been, but all I can remember is that we had a long chat about like a discount store that you love from your hometown, oh, yep, and that, you were like telling me about pretty accurate. And I was yep. like, "Tell me yes, more." You were was, like, "The sheets, the linens, yeah, yeah. That was dirt cheap." <laughs> oh my gosh, what was yes. the name of it? Because there's one in Houston that we go to called it, Tuesday Morning, and I don't know why it was called that. <laughs> There's a lot of Tuesday morning. No, but it's it yes. was like pre TJ Maxx. No, so this is look. Um, <laughs> <laughs> have to look at because I feel like we've talked about TJ Maxx before. Probably yeah. yes. yes, we have. Yes. Um, um. So okay. So dirt cheap. I get. I got very carried away. It's a. You see, I'm very excited right now. No I, <laughs> bargains. Really, I love a bargain. Is, I love is, a bargain. No, so it was. It was a store like they would get like. Um, like overstock and all this stuff from other places. So it would be, sometimes it would be a big Macy shipment. Sometimes oh, it was Target, Walmart. Yeah. It would just be all this stuff. And I would just, I have so many lunch bags. As right. a result. Oh my gosh. Right. There's no reason to have as many. As I, <laughs> as I have. But I was I like, they're a dollar. I'm like, everybody need. And I'm like, I don't even work anywhere to take right. a lunch I bag. But I went through I a sh- lunch bag bag phase for a while where you're like, I, I need a fancy lunch time. bag. Yeah. 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 Or like, like the bento box. Yes. Oh, I got to have a bento I'm box. Like they're insulated. I mean, they, I mean, yeah, it, it was a, yeah, I have, I've, I've, yeah, I've made some, this, no, this was a Target purchase. I once, they, okay, they had a lot of roasters on oh, right. that were seven dollars, yes. and uh. I bought several. Do I even cook? No, but <laughs> yeah. I, I got one for my mom, and I was like, yes. I got one for my aunt. I was like, oh, I got roasters, and my mom was like, mm. what? what you, like, yeah, why do you have a, a roaster? store like that? Like the appeal of the treasure hunt, where you're finding like, because you know TJ Maxx and like Marshalls to a certain extent, like they are actually making stuff cheap for that store, but then it's like when you get like the actual experience of the over flow it's mm. nothing better and it's oh, so hard God. to get that in new york because everything is so picked through right and- so, like if you go to this like b markets <laughs> i don't know if that would be the right b markets yeah. markets <laughs> uh things fall through the crack where yes. people don't know you're like yeah. Oh my god! I can't believe people don't understand that this is a coveted item. Yeah, yeah. And wait, what is it? Wait, do I know what is that? Is that a thing? What is a B market? Thing? Oh, I just get something me. that's not like the prime oh cities, like Chicago. Oh, the yes. cities. Wait, I yeah. thought you were saying a brand. I was like, is there a store called B market? Oh. I'm like, sounds great. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious. I was like, tips and I, tricks. I'm like, what tips am I tricks. missing? Yeah. Oh, just like not in the city. Yeah, yeah. Yes. everywhere. Yes. But yeah, everywhere is great. Yeah, yeah. But like here. going to. I remember one time Emmy Blotnick talked about going to a Target and. New York City, what a shit show it is. It'd be like a Dunkin' Donuts half drunken coffee on the shelf with a half eaten donut or a hot dog next to it. Yeah. And you're like, I can't, this is not a fun shopping experience. Yeah. yeah. Right. Target in New York is not fun. Yeah. Even, I go to the one yeah. on First Avenue or no, Avenue A, and it's like, that one's bigger. It's a little more fun, but it's like, someone's always being fired in there. You're yeah. like, I'm concerned for that guy. <laughs> <laughs> I have to like look out for the well being yeah. of the staff. It's- yeah, they're not. Yeah, not. Yeah, any any other city. Because when I come here, I'm always like, 
oh, like makeup's out of stock. Like everything is out <sighs> yeah. of stock yes. always, always. So. Right. Now, I love Georgia. It's such a beautiful place. Are you like a Southerner at heart? Do you love the South? Do you prefer New York? What do you think? Uh, you know, this is, uh, where do I even start? Let me see. Well, I, Georgia girl at heart, but yes. then, but I, you know, but I would say comedically though, my heart is here mm-hmm. right. comedically, mm-hmm. but yeah. like just as a living experience, Georgia I just is. I feel like people are, there's a kindness in the South. That, space. Yeah, there's space. That's really the, ma- yeah, the space is, yeah. yeah. And, and like when I'm hot in Georgia, I'm like, oh, this is the kind of it's hot. sultry. Yeah. Oh, it like, is. Yes. Like, oh. oh, but this this is the hot where you're like, ah, I'm, I'm ill. It's pavement like, hot. Yeah, <laughs> yeah pavement. Yeah, and true. like, it's so humid here too. Like yeah, it, it's yeah. different. It's a different heat. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, and it's a, it's gross. Yeah. Yes. Like, yeah. In Georgia, I might be like, Oh, I'm <laughs> you need a sweet tea. Yep. You need a sweet tea. Yes, yes. <laughs> I think too. Yeah, it's like in the South, it, the culture is like equipped to deal with heat. Yes, you know where there's so many like soothing things, and here it's just we're still running. <laughs> we're like still yeah, running. You still everywhere. have to go to the 34th Street station. Yeah, and it's just <laughs> yeah. a hot, just dirty sauna mm, down there. Just. Oh, but I got in the hot car um, today on the way here, and it's always I'm always like I'm fine. I can mm-hmm. I can handle yeah. it, especially if there's a seat. And then a, like two stops later, I'm like the hottest I've ever yeah. been yeah. in my yeah. life. Yeah. No, it's, I have a, a mini USB fan that I travel. Oh, with. I'm thinking yes. about be, yeah. doing that. You need it. I know Julia Solomon has one that goes around her neck like a half necklace. Yeah, and it stands out on both sides, and I'm I'm like I think I might start. Oh, I've doing seen that. that. Yeah, I love but anything so that you can wear around your neck. Jetsons, doesn't it <laughs> yeah. feel so Jetsons? It's yeah. Uh, yeah, futuristic. Yeah, but it's so yeah. I mean, it's nothing to just be like. Oh. Right. Yeah. I love that. There's a but, fan that comes with a misting bottle. Yes. Ooh, I've seen so it's just too, light yeah. water being spritzed in your. You're face. just like creating a weather system. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm for on, it. Yes. For it though. Now, um, what we were talking about a little bit before the show was you've had taken a few breaks, just going home, back to Georgia, like decompression time. And I remember we talked about this a couple of years ago after you had taken a break. And I was like so inspired by that because I think it takes, yes, inspiration. <laughs> yeah. But it's like you get so caught up in like going for it and like pursuing your passion and you're just grinding down. And mm. so tell us about the impetus of taking a break mm. what and the courage was it a conscious decision in the beginning or was it like you know what this is i feel like i don't have much on the books i'm going to take a break it was you know what it was or you're like i'm burnt out i'm not enjoying this all of those yeah yeah i think because mm-hmm. if, if it's the break that i think it's it was um i think it was going into 2022 yeah I think. yeah and yeah i went I went home for the holidays and then I was just there. And then <laughs> I kept going. I'm like, well, I don't really have anywhere to be. Yeah. You can just mm-hmm. be here. And right. just at my parents' house where I'm like, there's always snacks. And yeah. oh. just, it's just, you know, and no one, I mean, they do bother me, but not that, but it's that yeah. kind of thing. But where it's I'm manageable like, when there's mm-hmm. snacks and, and toilet paper, yeah, yeah. And all the paper yeah. products. It's quiet. Yeah. 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 And it's like the, you know, and sure, my parents are gonna. If I'm doing anything, they're gonna be like, "So, what are you? What are you doing right now?" Like, what? what <laughs> yeah. But but yeah. but I could some. I can mostly take un, uninterrupted naps. Not not always, but yeah. it was just the the piece of going. I don't really have to be anywhere yeah. right now, and I'm like, I could just not put in for oh. spots. Nobody's looking for me, and for a month is nobody knows. Yeah, nobody I'm knows. Like, Who? Nobody yeah. knows. Yeah, nobody knows. Yeah. Yeah. People <laughs> either assume that you're on a European tour. Yeah. You could take or, a year off. Yeah. Nobody will know. People see Nobody. you, they're like, oh my gosh, you're like, oh, I was in a movie. Yeah. <laughs> Straight to video. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, it was, but I just remember, and I remember like people going like, oh, like, are you, are you when are you coming back? And I'm like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> like, I just didn't, when, I didn't have an answer. I right. just did not have an answer. Yeah. And, but it felt good in a, because I remember going, oh, well, when I do get back on stage, mm-hmm. it'll be exciting you know or yeah and i'll feel like i you know and i go oh i still know how to do this even if i'm 
And That'll you stage. can rack up some new material. Yes. Where it yes. gets more exciting for yeah, you. Live a life rather yes. than doing the same venues every single night and then you're like no new experience. Yeah, you're yes. like, I had a falafel. I was running for the train. <laughs> you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's ex- yeah, and I and, and I think that's what ended up because um it's a joke that I sometimes will do in and out of my set, but it that stretch when I was at home, I ended up yelling at people at Panera Bread over a, <laughs> over yeah. a, of course, a, of over course. A, Panera yeah. Bread is a it's an experience I've always said it's like if you like airplane food but don't like flying <laughs> that's it's not that's, yeah but yeah. some people um Joe Zimmerman loves it and I got I discourse know. not just fun yeah. discourse from yeah. him about uh, it like uh, it is good, but then it's bad. It's, it's, that's the yes. yes. There are certain things, like for example, like a salad. You never want to get a salad there. But the broccoli cheese soup in the bread bowl it's very with the good. sandwich combo. What? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm like anywhere. A uh, serving bread yeah. in a bowl. Yes, please. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the, soup, soup in a bread bowl. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. A yeah. bread bowl full yeah. of more bread. <laughs> It's just a roll. It's just, just. I'll just have a loaf of bread. Just give me the whole, the whole thing. Yeah, I, they they do have good flatbreads. I will okay. eat flatbread yep. pizza, and then um, but then this their their what was it the lemonade that was killing people? Okay. Yeah. Like, oh, that's, that's right. Yep. Did they expect that? I don't think Panera well, was yeah. like what. You're not supposed to be drinking nope. that much of the lemonade. Yeah. <laughs> like four <laughs> yes when i first saw it i remember going this is i was with my mom and i and we were looking at it and she went oh it has that's a lot of caffeine and then we just didn't think anything else of it and then right. yeah. i started at, seeing those articles well if it's at panera it must be bland right. that's, <laughs> yeah exactly yeah. That's, how is it for loco happening in panera yeah it, it's it, it makes I, sense. I, that's something too that you don't expect to have caffeine and then you're just like having a wild day you know <laughs> speeding to pick your yes. kids up from ballet sorry i just yeah. came back from panera <laughs> right that should not even be a sentence you yeah know? like no one yeah. should ever like look like that yeah it's just yeah, it's a, but also my other thing with them too is that they're, some breads are a little hard. Mm, yes. Where yes. I'm like, this isn't, yeah. like, don't so you say you're you baking? Yeah. baguette, yeah. Oh, so what happened, and this was because I was at home, I and bored, um, I, so I misheard. They said a sandwich had pickled onions, but okay. I thought it was pickles or onions. onions. Oh, okay. And then, I, then we got into a, a an um, altercation. We did, and... <laughs> I and but and, and so and, and so when I was telling my friends about it when I was there and then and then when I came back here and then I finally went back on stage, I did it one night of the show and I was like, oh that was that was so ridiculous but it was fun to talk about because I was like yes. this isn't a I don't think this is a joke but oh I went no God. it's a joke because this is I mean I was yelling you got and heated I, oh I I was like for a, a misunderstanding about pickles or onions because I kept going I was like I was like no no I don't want pickles and she was like no it's pickled onions and I was like I said and then we just are yelling at each it's other. like a who's on first yes. Yes. happening yes. someone yes. else came on she yelled <laughs> and then I wow. screamed and I drove off and then um have you made an amends <laughs> oh let me tell you what happened I no I did not I I made it worse well, actually is, oh, I, I'm I'm in for this I, too I, so there and I do talk about this in joke, but there is a there's a Captain D's across the parking lot. Okay. I drove over there mad, nostrils flaring, and I was like, I gotta show them, you know, who like you don't talk to me like this about onions. And, <laughs> right. and I and I was like, I like she know I was like, she knows I didn't I just misheard her and I was like, how dare she? And I drove back through the parking lot and then I just started screaming out the window and flipping everybody off, <laughs> and and then yeah. and then and then I just left, and I was like, why? <laughs> I was like, why did I do that? I was like, this. Is... <sighs> and I then I was scared. I would not go back, and I kept I kept asking right. like I was like I was asking my mom. I was like, can you drive me? To Panera Bread, and she was like, "Why?" And I said, "I, I was like, go I, don't, into I, don't, I was like, I was like, hey, Vinny, I was like, can you do it?" Or I was like, "Do you think, you think Daddy can try?" Like I, I was love- begging my parents to. Oh yeah, my gosh, yeah, you yeah. banned yourself. Uh, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> well, my sister was like, "What did you do to them?" And I was like, "I said I don't just." Can you we're not me? talking right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> but 
I was going with, but I was like asking other people, like, can I drive your car so they won't just in You're case. You're going with the mustache. Yeah, no, was, yeah. Yes, I was, I was wearing hats. I the glasses so, and the... It was bad. I was, oh my but yeah, gosh. I was so embarrassed. I was like, I know. And it's only two mm-hmm. in my hometown. And I was like, I know they told the other one. Yeah, I was like, watch I out. They, told they the probably go back and forth. Yes! Yeah, they they swap employees if somebody's running late. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I was, yeah, I've been back since then, but I was, it, I was not proud of myself. That's all right. Yeah. That, when happens. you get pushed to the edge, yeah, we've pushed. all been there. I mean, I that reminds me of the time that I was, um, I got, I was in Texas and my flight got canceled, and I they did not rebook me on another flight. So instead, I decided to take a later overnight flight. But, and then I just sat in the bar and was drinking in the day and I was crying publicly. And I was like, "That, what yeah. was that? You know, yeah. like I just, I did not choose to go with the flow. Yeah. <laughs> right. I chose to swim upstream <laughs> I know. in a violent way. Right. I just had that. I uh, was trying to cancel my hotel reservations in Galveston because mm-hmm. it was raining and Galveston's already kind of like a charming dump. Charles yes, Barkley yeah. already went on a rant about it recently <laughs> about the brown <laughs> water. Oh, yeah. But when you're from Houston, you're yeah. like, this is what we've got as a beach. And we love it. And we accept it for what it was. But they, I didn't know that. I thought 24 hours was enough. I'm like, I'm not going to spend. And it was quite a bit of money for Galveston mm-hmm. that I was like, I'm not going to. And she went. She was like, well, we're still going to charge you the full Boom. amount. But then that's why there was. I'm just the part of me is like, you know, when you get in these fights, but you're like, I know I'm wrong, but I still feel like the morality of charging me this amount of money and I'm giving you 24 hours notice. I thought maybe they would dock me like maybe a hundred or a few hundred dollars. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But there is a part of me that's like they're, I guess, right. But I just didn't see it. It's no. hard. Yeah, it's hard it's when so you're hard. wrong in the argument, but you, you but still you're have also to stand like, your ground. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Public standoffs are the worst. I feel like I either cry or cave immediately. There's no in between for yeah. me. <laughs> There's yeah. no. Or I get pat like you get passive aggressive mm-hmm. where they're like, mm-hmm. <sighs> they said like I'm pretending having conversation <laughs> offline, but just being like insulting them to yes! a third party yes! that yeah. hoping they hear it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, his writing career is not going to take off. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. No. Oh, I've, yeah, yeah, it's rough. The, yeah, you play having, dirty. I play yeah. dirty sometimes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, now, one thing me and I were just saying, Sarah, before you came down, um, me and I have July birthdays. We both have her birthday. I'm not going to say it because of safety. I don't want someone <laughs> stealing you. your information. But my birth- birthday is July 15th. Nice. And so we're com- we're summer girls, but you said you really more prefer fall. I'm more of a fall person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I don't. I'm trying to. Rem- I think. I keep tracing it back to velvet boots in the early 2000s. Oh maybe. my goodness, I think, I a velvet that's, booty. I think that's where right. it came from. Yeah, yeah. 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 I like a, boots are fantastic. Yeah, I like a fall. Do you, you like know? a full boot or like an ankle? You know, I'm more. Of, well, can I? Can I, I don't know if it can really be a knee boot on me because of my height. But yeah. if it were knee boots on other people that yeah. are, <laughs> yeah. I think you could right below the knee. Tall on girls me. can pull off knee boots. Yeah, so I know my short friends said they can't pull off. Remember gladiator sandals? Yeah, oh, I could never do short, that. Yes. You yeah. actually look like you're a gladiator. wrapping it. Yeah, <laughs> I used to have yeah. Some, and you're right. And look, now that I think about it, I cut a good figure. In the, yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> yeah. Now, Mia, how tall are you? Give or take six feet. Give oh, got fabulous! Take, but I, it might be five eleven and a half. Now, what's your? How does that influence your fashion? So tall lady. Um. Well, you know what? I. It has gotten better over the years in terms of places where I can shop. Right. Good. So yeah. the options are quite. Yeah. Feels pitiful. like the the full sizing or whatever it's called now. Yeah, because this because there were like I can remember as a kid I would. I would think like, oh, I have to buy bigger pants so that can be longer. And then I, oh, yeah. yeah. And yeah. I remember a friend of mine saying one time, she was like, why are your pants? Like I was short. Wearing, you know, like they were yeah. short and wide. Like, and yeah. I was wearing at the time, I should have been wearing like a size six, but I was wearing 12s. Right. Because I was like, oh, I need the, oh my gosh. so they can set, you You're know, like, so I can yeah. get my belt. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was, I look, yeah. My friend was like, I don't think your clothes fit. And I was like, they fit just fine. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Like, they don't. Yeah. But. Yeah, but it's now, nice to have a friend that yeah lightly steps in. Yeah, I, I need <laughs> yeah. that changed yeah. my life. She really I talk about it all the time. Like I was like, remember when I all my pants sagged in the cross? Oh. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and you told me to stop being you ridiculous. Yeah, she was oh like, oh my gosh, she's like you 
should be wearing different clothes. I mean, I really was like, yeah, this is, this is fine. But right. Yeah. yeah. I think I think I may go back to mini skirts this summer. I'm feeling you kind should. of like, uh oh, am I a They're slut back. now? Am I a slut? Yeah. <laughs> no, wear, the, wear the mini skirts. Mini skirts or like the skorts at least. Like, because with a mini skirt, you're always like, I mean, you're a hair hair away from <laughs> well going up, showing the, the world. Yeah, yeah. When you climb up the stairs, I have to walk like this. Yeah. Just. Or, you know, if you go on the train, you sit down in the miniskirt and then you're uh, like, I think my vagina is yeah, touching yep, the seat uh, yeah, <laughs> through my underwear. But still, I can I can feel the texture. Nonetheless. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. No. Yeah. The thing, you know, I like the midi skirts, but for me, the midi skirt doesn't look right. And the maxi just we've talked about this. Like for me, a maxi skirt uh, looks like I've like converted a, to a religion. Yeah. That's, I feel orthodox. Yeah. Jewish that, lady coming through. Yeah. In fact, but fashionable, but fashionable, still yeah. conservative, yeah, <laughs> yeah. But now, yeah, like, where? So, where are there specific stores that you can shop for for at for tall? Yeah, what's your yeah. favorite? What's your favorite? Okay, fashion so brand. I found these places online. So, there's one place I've been ordering my. Because I'm in my tracksuit era. Um, oh yes, I love, love a tracksuit. Oh, they go for traveling. They, oh, every decade has a tracksuit, but it's yeah. styled differently. Yeah, yeah. There's a juicy couture. Then there was the '80s tapestry. Yes, I love track those. jacket, the silk, the yes, yeah. With yeah. The, like yes, a, yes. a teal yeah. green and some fuchsia mixed in. Yes, yes. Like the, yeah, it's yeah. Not in, in the and was that the was that the nylon? Was it around? That yes, yes. Like the parachute yes. one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah this this is, is a company I found called TJO Collection. They have Ooh. tall women track suits okay. and just jeans and all this other stuff then there's another another company called we exist okay. and they have like what i love is that their short pants are 35 are long insane. pants and i'm like oh, yes amazing that's the short and i'm like ah! yeah. You know, so yes. that's, yeah like they i think they go up to like 39 i don't need 39 but mm -hmm. it's nice to go wow i actually have pants that hit below my ankles yes. like this is great yeah yeah so, amazing. I'm, yeah, so i like well, finding those kind of places uh, annoying when you go through like fashion mags and you're like, I want to look like this. And then you so much trial and error of all the brands to figure out what yes. is looking good on you. Yes. Who has the time? It's a full time job. Yeah. yeah and, yeah. and so when you find that brand, it's very helpful. Oh, yeah. I'm yeah. getting into doing a little tailoring. I got a pair of silk summer Helpful. pants from buffalo exchange which is the only place i shop i just go in there and find something yeah. and i'm like this is me now <laughs> and but they're too long but they're really they've so i think i'm gonna get them tailored so they're like hit like right at the ankle and yeah. you know whatever they're 30 bucks the tailor will probably be a little bit more but it's like mm -hmm. then it's like 20 but it's you know it. yeah. i think it'll be worth it yeah i just got a i wore a suit recently from another tall lady place called prissy duck and Ooh, it was like prissy a duck. cool like sparkly suit but the pants were too long, which is very rare. Oh my yeah. gosh. So I had to get them tailored and I was like, ah, this never happened. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was so Moment. excited. Yeah. So was, a sparkly suit. Yeah. Oh, like, this yeah, sounds amazing. A whole, yeah, whole little sparkly. What, is there like an occasion or just Yeah. Yeah, I was just going, I was just going to like an event. Yeah. Oh, and I was I like, love I was it. like, I already have a sparkly suit in my what closet. What tone is the sparkles? It's uh it's uh the suit is black with like a silvery oh, yes. sparkle. Yes, I love it. I love I'll it. show you a picture. Oh yes, I want to see. But it was very cool to to go i have to get these altered oh my yeah. goodness <laughs> look at me hello <laughs> now um we were talking a little bit about your comedy central half hour um and you wore this gorgeous jumpsuit on there tell us about the i mean you, first of all you look stunning in that you. your hair is gorgeous your makeup's gorgeous can i just say i watch a lot of specials and it's hard to pull off a timeless look in specials Ooh. yes yeah and you look, nailed it look, it really is because Makeup artists also go through trends. There's some specials that I'm like, ooh, they put yeah. a lot of contour on this <laughs> yes, person. Yeah, yeah. Like, or it's a lot of bronzing happening yeah. going on right yeah. now. Um, that it, and then start, like I've watched a lot. Like we're like, that's a really bad outfit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but then you never the know. Like we had someone on who was telling us that she had done a special, and um, they brought her an outfit at the last minute that she didn't like. Oh, but no. they were like, well, this is what we want you to wear. Oh, no. that's crazy. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. But anyway, so tell us about how'd you how'd you arrive at the tracksuit oh. or at the jumpsuit? And because it looked fantastic on you, look, it was great. Well, I'm like, where do I do I look at the camera? Do I, <laughs> yes, who do I? Sultry, who do I, yeah. yeah. <laughs> My sultry Georgia heat. Um, no, I um, 
So it was it was a last minute decision, and I was I did not know what I was gonna wear. Running all over, yeah, so it was stressful. It was very str- and I was. It's your wedding, yeah, yes. and yeah. I was like, Literally. I gotta look decent, you know. And I'm like, what am I gonna be comfortable in? I need to find something, and so. Very, very, very last minute. The the friend, the one who told me that my pants were too big. Um, I was like, I need, you to come, heart. Yeah. I need you to come shopping with me. And we went running around. We were in the mall in, in we were in Atlanta. And we mm-hmm. were running around and we, she was picking up stuff like, what about this? What about this? And we see this jumpsuit. And she was like, I think it was on a mannequin. She's like, I think you could wear that. And I'm like, oh, okay. And yeah. then we, we looked mm-hmm. at it and then we went in the store and it, they didn't have my size. And then we were like, well, what size is on the mannequin? The size on the mannequin was my size. <gasps> oh, my God. And I put it on. It? And she was like, I think that's she was like, I think that's the outfit. She was like, I think I think that's the look. And I was like, I think it's I think it's the look. <laughs> yes. I think it's it. Yes. It's the look. Oh, my God. Yeah. I need so a friend just, like this. Yeah, this is an amazing woman. Yeah, she is. She I mean, like her fashion sense is amazing. Shout out to Lori. Um, Lori. But yeah, her. Yeah, her fashion. sense. But she she was like, let's try this look, this look. But yeah, that jumpsuit. She was like, I think. I think that's it. She was like, I think yeah. that's the one. And so I had like another backup outfit just in case. But what was the backup? It was like a, it was a dress. Well, it probably would have been a dress on anybody else. It was a dress mm-hmm. type thing. And then I was going to wear okay. leggings. But right. That, okay. Like the tunic. Jumpsuit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But um, it, but yeah, the jumpsuit, the jumpsuit was, was an A plus. I mean, you, you look like you look like a sexy like space captain or something like <laughs> look, running to save I the just, ship, you know, listen, with your humor. So no, yeah. what sh- what shoe did you wear with the jumpsuit? You know, I just wore a, just a regular black heel. Gotcha. Just a because re- at first yeah. I thought about red, and then I was like, I feel like if I get a red, she was gonna be too high, and then I'm not gonna be able to walk in it because it's gonna mm-hmm. be a it's gonna be. So I was like, let me just do regular regular ass black shoes. Yeah. 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 I saw it in the. I saw it today, yeah. and I, it worked perfectly. Yeah, worked perfectly. So it was gorgeous. Yeah. It's. I do feel like putting the outfit together for a taping is such a challenge, or for any event, even if you're like going to a wedding, you're like that's make or break in in terms of if you enjoy yourself. You know, yeah. yeah. You, you have a bad outfit on. You're oh. you're at the open bar. You're oh. you're on the loose. Yeah. I yeah. had that. Do you ever have that when you went to like high school? You had an outfit in mind, and then you put it on, and then it. There, it's not enough time and you have to go out the door and then for eight hours of that day you have to commit to your <laughs> shitty outfit. Yeah. It's like, it yes. like something you got oh. in the vintage. You know. oh. It's like being in a car that uh, involuntarily honks all the time where you're like, it's oh, so, I'm so embarrassed. I've, I have to call it out. Oh, little Miss Sunshine. I've, yeah. I've had that car. Yeah. 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 I, yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I, the, you just made me think about this. I, this It was an outfit I wore and I would never forget. I was in the fifth grade and I was around the time when, you know, your parents are like, sure, you can dress yourself. Yeah. yeah. And you have I, visions. You're like, <laughs> oh, in yeah. my head, I yeah. was like, I said, oh, I'm going to kill them with this outfit. <laughs> yeah, you're and like I, lime green. Look out. Oh, no, li- no. Listen, it was a it was a Mickey Mouse shirt <laughs> with a, a, a very thin lime green circle around it. And I was like, yes. you know what? These mint shorts. Shorts will be perfect. It will oh bring the, it will pop the ring. They yeah. were mint and white with like wow. white designs. And I had a pair of Reeboks that were dirty and gray <laughs> and white. And it just I looked a complete mess. But I was like, this works. <laughs> like just, and the whole day I remember somebody asking me about it. And I was like, I think I had my socks pulled up and I was like, this is just what I'm wearing. Man. I mean, it was so so bad it was so the funny. it was so but i when thought you have to defend your outfit oh, right like that's <laughs> what you like i just this was a choice you know like that it was a it was so bad oh, oh my gosh i do remember those oh. moments of being a, a young a budding young woman and just like p- planning to dazzle my friends oh. you know you're like getting ready in the mirror and you're like uh p- people will be asking yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah i don't i don't did you i don't know if you remember this sitcom or this reference but there was the the show Amen in the I remember a- Amen. Okay, okay. Yeah. so you remember the daughter Thelma Fry? Yeah, she always wanted to get married to the, the hot yes. deacon. Yeah, yes. no, the um, the um, the pastor. The pastor. Yeah, yes. her dad was the deacon. So you know, she always wore dresses and like her dresses. You know, it was she the was 80s. tall too. Yeah. yeah, and I remember one year I was going to a holiday party at my job, and I sent the pictures to one of my friends, and he was like. You look like Thelma Fry put that dress back. <laughs> and I was like, what? And I was like, I think this is what he was like. 
you don't he's like you don't he said you're not a high waist girl like you're not and, yeah and i looked in the dress like it, like it was <laughs> yeah. all and i was like this looks and he's like no 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 you need something else it's, and yeah, how it is so it bad. <laughs> it's so hard to see these mistakes on yourself we were because yeah. i want to talk about that we're going to talk about it in another episode, but we'll touch on it. Like I've seen a lot of trends on TikTok. It's called, people are talking about eyebrow blindness. Yeah. The blind oh, spots. Yeah. Where mm-hmm. you are, you don't know that it looks bad because every, we're all doing it, but it's like, right. it takes a friend to be like, what's going on? Yeah. Like yeah. you should not be parting your hair in the middle. Yeah. You know? yeah. Just confront you. Yeah. Yeah. Cause they were talking about 2016 eyebrows, but it is yeah. like the outfits are like that. You're in your mind thinking like, there has been times where I remember, in the early 2000s or late 90s, fedoras were big with the Britney yes, Spears. The fe- yes, and the fedora I era. I thought I could rock one. And then I and I was in my small hometown. Like, it wasn't small, but I went to the local bar and it took one photo. And I was like, oh, my God. Yeah, you look like it was the guy from NSYNC. Remember the guy from NSYNC was wearing them. Yeah, like, around. I know Justin Timberlake was there. They Joey were all Fatone. Yeah, yeah, Joey goes, Fatone. Yeah, it's oh, it, that's oh it was the thing because like Cameron Diaz we were and you're like yeah. I think I and you're yeah. you're the only one. I don't yeah. know. It was just no. I was, I was my town was not ready for me yeah. <laughs> and no, my I, fedora. Yeah. <laughs> I, I had I had a leopard print one, so that's oh worse. my gosh, fabulous! I, it was so fabulous. It was a magic. God. It was a full outfit. And oh my god! I was like, "Yeah, this is amazing." Yeah, my friends were like, "You look so." Good. I was like, "I know." Like I was <laughs> a full leopard. Pre- yeah, it was. A, oh god! Why was that? Oh Why? My gosh. I know. Yeah, I don't. Well, you're just like I thought. Britney Spears looks good, and I'm clearly kind of just like her. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Going to Sherlock's pub. Yeah. yeah, to hang out with people that have DUIs. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I just actually, I just, but the dress, my friend just reminded me of the Thelma Fry dress yesterday. That's why so that's, funny. That's why this makes me laugh even more because I'm like, we were just, he's like, remember that time? And I was like, yeah, yeah I remember because yeah. you were accurate. And yeah, <laughs> yeah I, which, you know, I yesterday I wore this, um, it was a pink, white, and orange shirt. And you know the guy that's outside the cellar that the with the um the golf yeah oh, he, Tiger Hood he, yes, yes yes I wore that shirt last year and I remember when I walked outside he was like hey Dunkin Donuts and oh! I, <laughs> no! I died I was no. like oh it does look like oh and then like two weeks later I wasn't even wearing it he was like Dunkin Donuts you back and I was oh! like <laughs> you're like no oh! I don't want a nickname oh! I don't want a nickname Dunkin from you Donuts I was like it's but it's, it takes one person. Yes. I, yeah. I remember being like, Vicky, my sister, and like, what do you think about these houndstooth pants? She's like, okay, <laughs> chef. Because that's all they wear. And you're like, oh my God, yeah. how did I not see these as chef pants? I had one like that where I had this, I had this striped um, maxi dress and I was like, perfect summer dress. And Mike saw it one time and he goes, hello, cat in the hat. <laughs> and I was like, burn it. No. Burn it. Oh, oh my gosh, I love it. Brutal. But I love a little fashion yeah. faux pas. I like a roast too, because there I weren't yeah. times showing up to thir- three sheets next to the cellar. This was when people were wearing light corporate wear to the bar. Oh, and yeah. this <laughs> guy <laughs> asked me if I was a flight attendant and I was like, <laughs> I'm just wearing a blazer, you oh, asshole. Oh no. Oh my god. Yeah, that's yeah, when it's accurate, that's the that's the part that that hurts because I yeah, yeah you can't even be yeah. hurt by it. You're yeah. like yeah, yeah. yeah well, you're like it's so you're, yeah, you're yeah, like, oh, it's insightful, just, yeah. very insightful. Yeah. That's another point of view I didn't take in consideration. Yeah. I look like Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah, because I, I, yeah. I, I was like, this is because it's like a linen shirt and like light yeah. and breezy. And I was what? like, this is you're yeah. telling so me the nice. colors. It didn't dawn on me on Dunkin' Donuts until you said it, until and I was like, you, oh my god, it is yeah. Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah, yeah. When you told me the colors, I was like, I love it. Yeah, and then pink and orange, and you're like. You oh. thought iced coffee immediately. Yep. <laughs> yeah, just straight up. Yeah, I. And look, oh, it's, and I'm sorry because I just thought about something. No, else. I'm, I'm no, loving keep all going, of these. Keep going. This is amazing. Okay, so there was the khaki um, jumpsuit that I wore, and I remember I sent my sister a picture. My sister is mean, and my <laughs> sister, sisters are great like that. Though my sister said she was like, "Oh wow, like are you about to go fix your plane?" And I, <laughs> <laughs> she, said, she was like, "You look like a mechanic," and I was like, 
God, oh she's like, gosh. no, seriously, where's your flight? I was like, can you oh my not gosh. say I look like an airplane mechanic? That's right. what you do, though. She was like, that's what you... But so that's, jumpsuits yeah. are tricky. Jumpsuits yeah. are tricky. And yeah. a lot of female comics lately like wearing them and yeah. it's become their it's brand. A great yeah. That stage. There yeah. are times where I want to wear one and then I have to tweet out who's wearing their jumpsuit tonight because we all can't be wearing them because we look like we're in a pit crew. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah, it just, just looks yeah. ridiculous. My my sister also has a theory too that it's kind of in that same realm of like if one person in your friend group is wearing the hat y'all all can't be wearing hats that's, that's like fair. the wide brim ones you yeah then it looks, <laughs> you can't yeah. get, a, get a group photo <laughs> yeah, yeah you yeah you only have to. one person is allowed to wear the hat in the group or yeah. it just looks that makes sense. silly that makes sense yeah i will wear a bucket hat i will wear a bucket hat and i think you know it's it's mm. very it takes courage <laughs> Think but you yeah. see an individual yeah. wearing yeah. okay yeah. a bucket hat. Yeah. yeah, I saw a girl wearing one yesterday, and I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll bring my up do a second chance with the bucket hat. Bucket hats, I think are. I think that yeah. they're coming back around. They're coming but. back around. Sometimes they're too small for my head. Yeah, oh. you got to get. Get to, I, oh. I, I don't buy a, an, a big enough bucket for my head. <laughs> <laughs> gotta get a bigger bucket. I feel like if we were all wearing it right now, somebody would think we were like a. A group that got put together on like, a, you know, X Factor, a women's group. Oh yeah, yeah. They're like, oh, obviously yeah. they. Yeah. Are you guys filming were, TikToks? Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that yeah would be like. What's, what's the show? Um, America's Got Talent. It would be something. Yeah. Right. Yeah, they would be like, oh yeah, they were all individual a women's singers, group. All yeah, like bucket hats. Mothers Against Drunk Driving. <laughs> yeah, <be a> group. <laughs> you know? Yeah, like that's we would look like a singing group for real. I, I do love it when singing groups match. I think it's. I Amazing. Mean, it's kind of the like when everyone is wearing like they do like the matching, but everyone has like a slightly different yes, the variation. Like, yes. Destiny's yeah. Child was like that. Yes, yes. 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 Or coordinated, or yeah. kind of like bridesmaids. Yeah, right. like we're doing a bridesmaids yes. look. Yes. It was amazing. But yeah, I love fa- fashion fails. Fashion fails. The best to relive. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, the, yeah. I look and the back. delusion. So, because it is funny, you're like, again, we're like, oh, I maybe I didn't give the bucket, maybe I didn't wear the bucket hat with something that should have gone with it. And then you're like walking around the city holding a bucket hat, just yeah. angry and with yourself. Like, Damn it, I fell for it again. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It got I, me again. Yeah, I yeah. I I wore a green blazer one of the first times I was on you see TV it on the and catalogs, and you're like, she looks good. Yeah. And I look like yeah. I just won the Masters. Like, that, <laughs> it was, I said, like, why did nobody say anything to me? Yeah. I was yeah. like, yeah. nobody. They were like, that looks good. It's a primary color. And I, yes. I, was, I was like, I look straight up like, yeah. Because so things that you like, so like bad. colors that you like, sometimes yeah. it doesn't look right on your skin. Like, yeah. I love lilac is like my all-time favorite color i think it's so beautiful like pale pale purple and i remember i was like trying to plan an outfit for something and i was like sh- you know i wanted to buy this like 400 dollars. obviously i would return it but like yeah. you know don't get crazy <laughs> yeah. but um and and i remember somebody being like you're gonna look like a ghost with that yeah, and you're like oh like we're yeah like branding with these we, we're getting rid of these because we feel like it washes it looks like camouflage to us. <laughs> so, yeah. We're going to go with light blue. I know. We're going, we're. I came in here going, I feel so peaceful. You like this. I know. Isn't this gorgeous? It's like, oh, little peach, little peach. But, um, but yeah. So as we're wrapping up here, Mia, I wanted to ask you, what's your journey that you're on right now? What is my journey? Um, Let's see. What am I? <laughs> what, no pressure. What is my journey? Right. Let's see. Your, your self are, care. Are something that you're I, like into, like beverages, ooh, or yeah, like, like what's oh. your self care splurge? Right now, um, what do you do when you're by yourself? Yeah. Well, this is uh, this is what I've been doing lately. Um, this is can you, it's not in, it is embarrassing, but it's not. But okay, do you remember when Trader Joe's used to have like the swirled cookie butter? <laughs> yes. But it was it was the chocolate and the, oh, the yes. just the regular cookie. They stopped making the swirl. Yeah. And so now I have to buy two separate ones. <laughs> so I get the cocoa yeah. almond spread mm-hmm. and then I get the regular cookie butter and I swirl it myself. Oh, a little self swirl. I do swirl it myself and then so I when dip people are like, fruit. Uh, me oh, uh, amazing. These cookies are amazing. You're like, um, I swirled them myself. I swirled my cookie butter. <laughs> Trigger Joe's. Yeah. They so. will 
they're vicious yes. with like I used to love an olive tapenade that they would make. I feel like I remember hearing about that. Oh my god, it was so good. I would just eat it from the jar like a maniac. I, I love olives, and this was and they just you've never seen it again. Like you'll fall you in bring love it back with and something. It yeah, something else. They had a horseradish hummus that I love. Oh. You'll you'll fall in love with something there, and then they it's gone. It's gone. Yeah. It's gone. Where they had they a, go to? a vanilla frozen yogurt. Never seen it again. Never seen it again. It's like yeah, they just. They the, I mean, play the, games. The, this will be TikToks years from now. I'll be like, remember this treat at TikTok or at <laughs> yeah, yeah. Trader sure. Joe's? There's so much yeah. Trader Joe's subculture going on. It like, it is, and I never get to indulge in it because I've never been near a Trader Joe's. Oh, I'm a TJ scale. Yeah, they well, do feel like they're far. They don't have from, an Astoria. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They also are not a complete grocery store where yeah, you go in there and you're like, I want banana store. peppers. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's a snack not, store. Yeah, but it's but yeah, I, I will. But yeah, I miss the the. Priest world, oh, priest world, in like a person in the thirties, <laughs> yeah, you know, just churning butter, just <laughs> I love that, just, yeah. But I, but I will dip it in fruit. I do want to make that. Clear. Oh yeah, just, yeah. Just what it, fruit? It, what it, fruit do you um, go for? Granny Smith apples. <gasps> I love a, the tartness yes. with sweet. Yeah. I yes. love a, I love a Granny Smith. Yeah. Well, just to close out here, I have a few little summer would okay. you rather. All right. Okay. So okay. these are, you know, uh, we love seasons here at Lady Journey and. And um, you are, you already confess that you're more of a fall, but still. Okay. So if you're going out, would you prefer soft serve ice cream or an artisanal popsicle? Ooh. Uh, Tough, right? Damn, I know. These are so not going to be easy. That these is, are not going to be easy. In this case, I'm going to have to pick the popsicle. Yeah. Mm, I, I'd say yeah. popsicle too, only because I read something recently that Froyo <laughs> or like soft serve is really hard to clean the machines. So a lot of times they have bacteria. In so it is true when yeah. you go no. to the fast food joints and they're like, they're, it's, they're, it's this, broken. It's yeah. broken. Well, you see okay. those Mr. Softy, like I used to get that all the time. And I read a news article that they said they conducted a survey no. of them and only five were clean. Uh, I was like, no. <laughs> I've been eating that for right. dinner. No. <laughs> so, okay. but I love, I love like a, like a, you know, basil, you know, like one of those, like, like a basil yes. a watermelon, like yes. popsicle. And you're like, mm, oh, yeah. so sophisticated. No. I'm with that. Okay. Now um, for morning, mimosa or green juice? Uh, mimosa. Okay, yeah. okay. Um, picnic or patio? Patio. Me too. You know yeah. why? Back support. Back support. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And Back support. Picnic is great in theory, but you're just sitting there with like- You're your... hunched over. <laughs> yeah. The cold yeah. ground is right. like seeping you know, in through the blanket. Wet. Yeah. yeah. Yes. It's always yeah. mysteriously wet. Where you're like, yeah. it seems fine. And you're like, no, I made- a, it's Yeah. <laughs> we were sitting yeah. in groundwater. Yeah. Marks. Now, yes. patio also, I will say there's a bathroom close by, likely. And that's yeah. important yeah. for me, who it must pee every hour on the hour. Um, oh, linen or silk? Linen. I love a linen. linen. I've been stocking up on some linens this summer, yeah. and it's just ugh, so breathable. Um, okay, for a weekend getaway, town or beach? Oh, look, my stomach's growling. So um, both places because they have food. Um, yeah. No, yeah. Um, wait, town or, let me see, you said town. Town or beach? You know, I'm not a beach person. Okay. I'm so town. Yeah. I have to go to I a town. Ugh, yeah. I love um, a town. Yeah. They have restaurants. They have yeah. oh, a little uh, coffee stroll in the morning. Yeah. I, yeah. A beach. I don't, I did not pass swimming lessons as a child. <laughs> so. How about but, yoga or Pilates? Ooh, let me see. I feel like yoga. I'm going to go with yoga. Yoga. I feel like I, I always pick Pilates. I'm a Pilates person now. That's my identity. The intimidating to me. I, Although I just I do four Pilates. I force Sarah to watch my Pilates routines <laughs> <laughs> when we're together, but Pilates is easier than yoga, I think. Like yoga, I is always it? am like, oh, because yeah. you're holding, yeah, because you're, you're, you're kind like, of uh, laying down the whole time. Like uh, yoga, I'm like, I can't get through it. Oh, really? uh. oh, I love, I lo love Pilates. Okay, moving on. Sandal or sneaker? Sneaker. Same. I gotta go sneaker in the summer, especially walking around the city. I'm you like, you don't want your toe out. No, I. That's when I. Every time I'm on a train and I see, I'm like, how? This you see stressful. people in little flip flops. Yeah, I somebody had. I saw a reel today of some woman just talking about how gross it is to wear flip flops in the city, and I I won't do it just because I get blisters. But nowadays, it's not even that. You're like, I just have old lady feet. Yeah, I know. It's like, am I, I going to go spend fifty dollars on a pedicure so I can yeah. have yeah, my I, toes exposed? Yeah. No, I'm. 
Yeah, yeah sneakers the thirty dollar one is not cutting it for me. Yeah, I need to no, have yeah. my foot scraped um, with a cheese grater. <laughs> sneaker is yeah. Sneaker, love it. Oh, farmers market or vineyard. Ooh, farmers market. <gasps> oh, yeah. I love a farmers market. Yeah, I love oh, a yeah. farmers market. Um, and oh, that's the last one. <gasps> oh no, my journey has ended. I know. <laughs> to an abrupt halt. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had more. I thought I had, yeah. You're out. Get out. <laughs> the right. lady journey is over. Yeah. <laughs> like tracksuit or jumpsuit. Get me more. <laughs> I know. Aren't Get those fun? More. Aren't those fun? I think I was this morning. I was like, I should think of more. And I was like, no, nope, busy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mia, so, thank you so much no, for coming on Lady Journey. Yeah. Yeah. Um, tell everybody where they can find you. Let's see. I can be found at Mia Comedy and MiaJackson.com. Uh, MiaJackson.com, so, Mia yes. everybody. And please make sure you check out um, our Lady Journey live stand up show. We'll be performing with some friends here in Astoria, Queens um, on June 26th. Yes. I'm looking at Sarah. I'm like, when Don't is it? Don't look at me. <laughs> Sarah's like, I have nothing to do with this. June June 26th, 2024, 7 p.m. Tickets are all over all of our social media. And, and also, please give us a like and subscribe. Yeah. Lady Journey. Lady Journey.